against the Bombers, and the Roos' cause looked even more desperate when a spate of injuries hit them in the second and third quarters. North lost Rover Graham Melrose with a calf injury at half-time. Coach Ron Barassi sent his 20th man on to replace Ruckman Terry Moore, who was completely out of touch in the third quarter. And then minutes later, Barassi watched in horror as defender Ross Henshaw limped off, nursing a broken collarbone, just three minutes before three-quarter time. And don't forget, there were no interchange players in those days. So at three-quarter time, North trailed by five points, and the stage was set for a thrilling climax. Let's look at the teams. Key players for North Melbourne were Rover Barry Cable, forwards Malcolm Blight and Robbie Smith, while for Essendon, great ruckman in Graham Moss, who was to win the Brownlow medal in 1976 and return to Perth, and a very strong centre-half back in Ronnie Andrews. Well, let's go back five years to one of the heart-stopping finishes of the decade. Michael Williamson welcoming you to the final quarter of this match of the day, North Melbourne versus Essendon. We go into the final quarter with the news that North Melbourne are 6 6 42, five points behind the Bombers who are 6 11 47, and North have 17 men on the field. They go into attack. Andrews uh, can't get a clear grab of that ball. And look at this uh, scramble going on. Cowton's in that. Yes, Barassi replaced uh, Melrose and Moore with. Tanner and Douglas, and then just before three-quarter time, Henshaw, the back pocket player, with an obvious broken collarbone, had to leave the field, and so North, 17 men, one shot as they go into the final stanza. North driving that ball forward, it may have gone over the line on the full, and we find Ken Fletcher that now it's Roberts to take it. Lou Richards. And the ball goes across towards centre-half four. Now, half flying high that time was Dench. He couldn't hold the mark, but he's still in there. Better get a free kick. Yes. He was grabbed, didn't have the ball that time. And Dents takes the free kick and a hand pass coming over the blight, now playing on the back line. North got the task ahead of him with 17 men on the ground. Here we see Count running around his opponent. He goes for a hand pass over to Dents again. But North Melbourne are still battling on well as they trail by five points to Mark the Smith. Well, let's see whether it would be a bit of a miracle if they can win this. A short pass. Well, they're even creating the loose man, North. Here's Count breaking clear as he takes the mark. Ready to fire for goal. He's kicked one. No one point. Well, we're not up out of a jet north. 43 points to 47. Six goals. Six goals, 7 43 north. To uh, the Bombers, 6 11 47. Waiting now for the ball to come back into play. It'll be Noonan. Coming out to the 10 metre mark. The Bombers should be, should be full of confidence. A long kick by Noonan. Well over the centre half forward position. Ooh. There's Crow getting up. He's taken some great marks today. A chance now for Hickmont to get clear. Greg battling hard. They seem to be inspired, North Melbourne. The ball comes out. Picked up by Fletcher. A left foot kick down towards the uh, half-forward line. It's pushed out. A chance now for the ball to be driven away by North. But we can see them battling hard. Park trying to get through that time. Down they go, and the umpire will ball it up. That set a half-forward for uh, Essendon this time. Right with the umpire to bounce the ball. Be Nolan and uh, Moss. Moss has played a magnificent game today. And he'll get a free kick from that one from Nolan for a bit of a shove in the back that time. Been a great player. Knocking the ball out, hand passing beautifully to his teammates and also taking some lovely marks. Waiting on uh, Moss. Actually got the breeze right on his tail. Just about land this in the goal square, I'd say. Oh, he's hooked it a bit out towards the forward pocket. And a good mark down there to Dench. A long hand pass out towards Montgomery. He's been a brilliant player for North, two on that half back line. Sends the ball back towards the uh, wing position to mark the tenner. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, oh take the mark, a free kick. kick. And the free kick will go there to Wick, just about at centre half back. Wick about to drive North into attack. He tries a short one and it comes off here. Taken by Cowton. He gets it across here towards Tanner. Tanner of North Melbourne, a big kick into the forward zone. Burns from the Yes, Burns has taken it. And Burns is 20 metres out. Maybe 25 at a stretch directly in front. Four points of difference in favour of Essendon. And it's Burns of North Melbourne. Up he comes directly in front. He kicks. He's put it through and North in front. At the three-minute mark in the final quarter. The scoreboard reads, North Melbourne, 7-7, seven, seven, 49, Essendon, 6-11, 47. Two points of difference in favour of North Melbourne, 70 men on the field, North.
Sweeney. To the centre now, Moss and Nolan, up they go. Knocked out by Moss again, cleared away by Walsh. Now it's uh, the Bombers' turn to go into attack. Oh, beautiful mark to Crow. He didn't pay it. A hand pass to Grieve. Hey, Gilly, what are you going to do to take a mark? If we see Blake take the ball away. Good play by North. And they're back in business again as up goes towards the forward line. Going after it now. Here's Watson and Burns. It's Watson coming in with the ball. But they're going after him. He's trying to break clear. It'll be a ball up for sure, I'd say. Now it's Burns coming out. They're pushed in the back. He said play on. They don't give any free kicks at the moment as we see Fields take the mark on that half-back line. Fields on the half-back flank on the southern side. Takes his kick, oh, it's a big kick down towards centre half forward. Plenty of north defenders there. And a screamer pulled down by David Dent. A quick hand pass to Blight. Blight into the forward zone, but there's only Fields there. Oh, it's a complete by Greg. And it's North going forward once again. Greg, a big kick, but waiting there is Watson. He couldn't get to it, however. The ball is pushed forward here by a count. In comes Shimmerbush. Shimmerbush is going to Schimmelbush, 20 metres out, no more than 20 metres out, on a slight angle, so slight you can say directly in front, there's Barry Cable, a veteran of many games, telling him what to do, can he do it? Up comes Schimmelbush, this is important, he kicks, he's missed it, he hooked it, not a good kick from him. But still, one point results. North Darwin now go to 7 8. 50 that will be to Essendon 6 11 47. What a slow scoreboard. As the kick from Noonan goes straight down the centre. Up goes Nolan, knocking the ball clear, but the man in front, Mark Dawson, will be paid the mark. North putting the pressure right on and keeping it there. Down into the forward zone. Up goes Burns. Almost a screamer. Out comes Grinter with the ball. He's tackled by Count and he loses it. But Grinter butters up once again. Oh, and there they go. Grinter's still going. Well done, Grinter. Kicks in towards the centre. Nolan gets it over to Cable. Barry Cable from a long way out kicks. It'll be an Eston mark here, I reckon. Oh, they spoil each other. In comes Andrews. Andrews of Eston takes his kick. Oh, and hands out a free kick here. It'll be a free kick, Mike. A free kick back here, I'd say. A free... No, it's not. It's out of bounds. I thought there'd be a free kick behind play that time. Could easily have been. There's the kick now by North. Up towards their full forward zone. Oh, they're all flying on a mark. The grid. A free kick to Smith. Yes, he was pushed right out. Chance now for North. No, he was pushed right out. He pushed out that time. He's already kicked three goals. Oh, aren't they in trouble now? The Bombers and and, uh, North are playing with 17 men. Oh, what a performance by the Northerners. Here they go now. Smith going for his fourth goal. And this will be a nasty one for the Bombers. Look at Andrews yelling out there at the side of the mark, to, trying to put him off. The kick, no doubt about it, it's a goal. And North Melbourne now, eight goals, eight. 56 points to Western, 6 11, 47 points. Not a bad lead, nine points in favour of North Melbourne and we're coming up to the eight minute mark coming up to the eight minute mark in the final quarter now who's coming on there number 38 that's uh, Foles Foles coming on by the look of it for uh, Essendon don't know who's coming off the runner Barry Capuano going across the field to speak to some player but back in the centre Nolan taps it out once again Nolan's there with the ball, but he can't break clear. Essendon have the opportunity to go forward. The kick now from Walsh goes to the half-forward flank on the southern side of the ground. Nobody able to pick it up. Oh, it could be a free kick to Malcolm Blight or a ball up. I'd suggest a ball up. Grint is off and Foles is on. There's a the bounce of the ball. Essendon's half-forward flank. It's knocked away. Chesnell comes in there, but it's big Mick Nolan coming out with the ball. Kicks it to the wing position on the southern side. Newton and Schimmelbush could be a free kick now as a throw-in. A throw-in on this wing position. Waiting for the ball to come back into play now. The Bombers are a bit rattled as the ball is knocked out that time by Nolan. Picked up by Chesnell. And as they go for North Melbourne, Smith couldn't hold the mark. The ball is out of bounds. Out of bounds on their half. The, uh, it's the Douglas, I should say. Ball back into play again. Up it goes. 
Hard grab by Moss. He tries to get it away. He finally does over to Wilson. A high punt kick back towards centre half forward. There's Blethen there. He can't get it. They punch it away, the North Melbourne defenders. A battle between Greve and Fletcher. Beaumont's there going after as Wilson. A beautiful pickup. And he hooks the ball up towards the goal square. At the back is Gumbled on the golf road. Couldn't pick it up that time, Walsh. And they're all in there battling. Down they go, left and right. The umpire's going to ball it up. About 20 metres out from the bomber goals. And they're trailing by, what, uh, six, nine, nine points. points. Up it goes now. Knocked out by uh, Gumbledon. Over there to Wick. Trying to get a hand pass. Out towards Tanner. He can't pick it up. But as it go now, as the ball comes back, and we see Tanner take the ball away. Way for North Melbourne. Round towards Douglas and Foles. Foles gets up. Couldn't hold the mark. Counting trying to get paying the mark. Paying the mark to, yeah. uh, to Essendon. Yeah, and I'll take the free kick of be Foles. I paid the mark, Lou. I've no doubt in my mind about that. Up comes Foles to take his kick. Kicks it in towards the centre. Oh, it's Moss waiting there. Decided to uh, get it uh, straight down the ground. Didn't go to that uh, northern flank at all. It's uh, Gumbledon knocking the ball clear now, but it's taken away there by uh, Fields. Neville Fields, he'll place it pretty well, and he does so. It's Walsh to take the mark. And Walsh would be... Oh, well, he's a good 60 metres out, but that wind is right off his tail. He's kicked two goals. Ryan Walsh. It's on its way by golly it's across the face of goals however no mark there's a scramble going on it's blight coming out it's not a very good kick but he gets it out here towards greg greg will get a free kick no it's called play on blimey in comes Stephen Nick. Stephen Nick tries a hand pass towards Cable, but it's Andy Wilson chipping in for Essendon there. The ball goes forward once again. Here's a chance for Tanner, but it's Byrne kicking the ball forward. It's been marked by Crow. Didn't travel very far, but Crow has kicked one goal. It'll be a miracle if he kicks this. It's on its way, but it's off the side of his boot. Up they go. They spill the mark, however. Taken by Walsh once again. Walsh is in there. He gets his kick through for... One behind. So it's eight points of difference now. North Melbourne are 8-8, 56. That will make Essendon 6-12, 48. Eight points of difference in favour of North Melbourne. It looks as though Byrne, number 21, the half-back flanker, is going to kick out, which allows Dench, of course, to go further down the ground and do his business there. He tries a short one. Byrne comes out to the half-back flank out there. Tanner goes up. Doing battle, in comes Dinks, that's the fellow I was talking about, the regular fullback. He's got it up to the wing position, about to be tackled there by Ken Roberts. And there'll be a throw in on the wing position on the outer side. 11 minutes of this last quarter gone, and what a beauty it is. And you're watching it on Channel 7. Ball back into play now. Moss gets the grab that time on good play, but he loses the ball. Couldn't get clear, but he goes after it again. Good play by Moss. As the ball comes over to Western now. Kicked up there by Hickbot, up towards the full part, fullback. Oh, get the ball. Pay it. Yes, he has. He's going to pay that. By golly, you'd have to pay that one. What a beautiful mark by Malcolm Blake. Well, they're playing inspired football, North Melbourne. Playing with 17 men. And the Bombers are in the hot seat at the moment as they trail by eight points. And we've played 12 minutes of this last quarter. Oh, he's gone for a dangerous kick. Let's say Dawson's got it. Goes for a bit of a run. Gets the ball around, around towards Dents out there on the half-back line. And Dents is going through like a steam train. Hand pass over to Tanner. Tanner sends the ball down towards that uh, half-forward line. It beats Smith and uh, Noonan. Picked up by Andrews. Andrews gets clear. He chose strength that time. A beautiful play as he sends the ball well down towards the half-forward line. Uh, picking up Willis Blight, but he's dropped it. Going after it again as Blight. Oh, he's kicked off the ground. Wells can't pick it up either. And they're battling hard. Montgomery's in there. And the ball is out of bounds. Well... That North Melbourne defence is standing up pretty well. It's the Bombers, they've got to get up now. They're trailing by eight points. Ball into play now. McNolan and uh, uh, Allen that time. Down it comes. Scrimmage developing. Neither side can get out the umpire's playing a free kick. The wheel high. I think it'll be Wilson to get the free kick. And he's well within kicking distance. If he gets this one, he'll make it two points the difference. He's already kicked one goal. Andy Wilson from about 30 metres out on a very slight angle. And this is a desperate one for the Bombers. The kick. That's OK. It's a goal. A 
only two points the difference now. With North Melbourne, eight goals, 8.56. To North Melbourne, to Western, 7, 12, 54 points. Tremendous effort if North can pull this off. Up they go, Moss and Nolan once again. It comes down here to Fletcher, kicks down towards centre half forward. Through they come, Cable coming out with the ball now. Look at this fella go. Cable gets it up towards a half forward flank. Up goes Hickman of Essendon and it takes the mark. Actually, between the half forward flank and the wing position on the southern side. Hickbot kicks in towards centre half forward. Oh, big McNolan comes through and takes the mark. Mick rucks tirelessly all day, although we're full of praise for Moss. You can't overlook the great job that he, uh, Nolan's done. A hand pass from Malcolm Blight. It goes to Keith Gregg. Gregg from the wing position. Oh, free kick down the field. Yes, Beaumont. Beaumont. Down him after he kicked. There was no doubt about that. And the kick now from Douglas. But through comes Noonan like a train. But it's a trap there, however, by uh, Douglas. Douglas, a big kick forward. And it goes over the boundary line in the forward pocket for North Melbourne on the southern side. <laughs> well, here's the pressure right on. Can North sneak one through here? Players in position. Boundary umpire. In it comes. In goes Moss. Cowton gets up from behind. The ball is tapped down here. It's driven out of danger. No. It's taken there by Cable, but not quite. The ball is smothered there off the boot of uh, Roberts. There's a scramble. It could be a ball up. No, it's called power. And there'll be a ball up now or a free kick. A free kick going to Fletcher. And the North Melbourne fans quite disgusted. Fletcher kicks in towards the centre. Here's a go. Douglas is in there. In comes uh, Walsh. Walsh taps the ball across. Out comes Parks with it. He's grabbed by Burns. Burns is still in there struggling to the ground. It comes. The ball pushed forward here. Picked up by uh, Tanner. And what's happening? There'll be a bounce. A bounce slightly into North Melbourne's territory. The wind pretty strong here as the ball goes to turf. Nolan and Moss once again. There they go. Moss takes it. Gets a hand pass across here. Picked up by Neville Fields. Fields goes down to the half uh, forward flank. The mark missed there by Montgomery. They overrun the ball. In comes Ick. Ick of North Melbourne. Goes uh, wide. Over the centre, up goes Greg, but the ball is knocked away there by Andrews, picked up by Fletcher. Fletcher of Essendon, a big kick into the forward zone. Up goes Blethen from behind, couldn't quite drag it down. Montgomery kicks the ball in. The players overrun it. Chisnell just couldn't get the bounce of it. In comes Tanner once again, too high. Yes, they've got a free kick, Tanner. A free kick to Tanner down there on the half-back line. He was pushed in the back. No doubt about that. A quick bit of play over the cable now. Cable's going for a run. Let's see what this little champion does with the ball. Oh, he's gone for a long hand pass to Greg. Greg's got the ball. Bill's, uh, Greg's on the wing position, the hand pass to Blake. Oh, there's a dangerous one. Ken Dawson pick it up, though, it's out of bounds. They're still in front by two points, North Melbourne. Ball back in the play now. Moss coming over. Moss and Cout. Grabbed by Moss again. He can't get clear. Umpire said, hold the ball against him. This is the first mistake he's made all day. And they give it to attack North. Up towards Smith and Noonan. Oh, Mark Douglas, Douglas has got the mark. And they're all kicking down there, quick kicking down there, Sam. Oh. He's having a kick, another good one. The wind catches it, comes back. They get the hand, Smith, there's Simabush now, he can't get out. There's Watson trying to get clear, he's grabbed. A chance now for Smith, he snaps for goal, and it's out of bounds. Out of bounds, right against the point post. And North Melbourne have a chance to score a goal. Still playing with 17 men and two points in front as Cowton tries to grab it. Well, it's finally taken away that time by Newton. And a mark taken by Parks out there on the half-back line. Back it goes now towards the wing. Ah, oh, good mark. Pushing the buck and the free kick will go to Hickmont out there on the wing position. Can the Bombers take this lead away from North Melbourne? We see Hickmont drive the ball well around towards the half forward line. Oh, beautiful yes. mark to David Dent, and he's played a great last quarter too. That defence is doing a great job down there. They're holding him out all the time as the ball comes around towards Tanner, and yeah, Tanner's got the mark. The boy coming on its not his man at half time. Oh, shocking kick. He's let Eston in now. They're going down by nine pence. will be a free kick, and a free kick will go to Welch. Well, I don't know whether it was enough, but the umpires are under tremendous strain too as the ball goes right down towards that forward pocket. Dent couldn't hold the mark. He tries to get it out now. We see the ball taken away by North Melbourne as the ball goes right across the goals and right across on the defensive side and out of bounds 
about 70 metres around from the uh, bomber goal. Coming up to the 19 minute mark, two points of difference in favour of North Melbourne. There's a throw in. Up they go. Allen gets up from behind there, tries to tap the ball now. It could be a free kick to Burns. Got it from Foles in the back. Burns now kicks up towards the wing position. Moss is there. And uh, that's a dangerous place to put the ball near Graham Moss. He hand passes over to Newton. Newton hooks it in towards centre half forward. But a diving mark to Stephen Nick of North Melbourne saves the day. Nick. Oh, what a tremendous performance North are putting up in this final quarter. The kick from Mick comes up to the wing position. Players set themselves. Douglas is in there, so too is Dawson for North. But it's Newton of Essendon coming out with the ball. Doesn't travel a great distance. It's not clear. Take by Shimmerbush. Shimmerbush gets his kick in, but it's going to be close to the boundary line. As up goes Douglas, almost pulled down a ripper. Through comes Andrews. He's on the ground, and there'll be a ball up on the wing position on the southern side. Umpire, Lions, Harvey Lions about to bounce. And listen to the North Melbourne crowd, they're going mad. Nolan and uh, Moscow for it. There could be another ball up here, I'd reckon. Still in this wing position. Didn't travel very far at all. Nolan and Moss once again. Who's going to come out on top? There's Laurie Maloney of uh, Essendon getting ready to come on. The ball goes down to Andy Wilson. He kicks it forward. The North defenders cut across. It's Montgomery. Tackle there by Foles. Maybe a little bit high. The ball comes across here. And it goes to Schimmelbush eventually. His kick going up into the forward zone. Mark Dawson is there. It bounces and bounces over the line. And there'll be a throw in between North's half forward flank and the wing position on the southern side. Well, look at the ball to come back. Moss and Nolan again. Up it goes. Knocked out by Moss. Hardly missed one all day, but Greg's got it this time. A hand pass coming back to Chisnell. And North Melbourne go to attack up to their half forward line. Over the heads of pack, there's uh, Newton and uh, Dawson going for it. But it's going further up towards the North Melbourne goal. And, and they're still hanging on by two points. Maloney is on and uh, Allen is off for Essendon. Well, they'll need a few more the way they're going. The ball knocked out again that time by, uh, by Count. There's a go for Smith and Newton going after it. But it'll go through for, for a point and that'll put the bomber uh, the North Melbourne side in front by three points. <laughs> Approaching the 21, or a bit after the 21 minute mark. I'll be 8 9, 57, Lou. Here we go now. The ball back into play by noon and out towards that half back line. Moss in the front seat, and he's grabbed the mark again. Played a superlative game as the ball is grabbed by Montgomery. Still going out. He's been pretty close to him all day, too, as he picks up the ball with the umpires played a free kick, and the free kick will go to Parks. For a trip, Lou. For a trip. Parks to take the free kick on the half back line. Drives the ball back towards half forward now. And a mark, two blight. I think a few had a grab at that one, but he's got the mark on the half-back line. They've stood up pretty well, that defence of North Melbourne, Great in this effort. last quarter, haven't they? Great effort, Lou, as Malcolm Blight comes up to take his kick. He tries a hand pass over here towards Cable. The intelligent footballer puts it up towards centre half forward. Plenty of Eston defenders there, but it's Cowton coming out with it. Cowton drives down forward. Here's a go for North Melbourne. It's a mark to Smith. Smith is going to play on. No, he's changed his mind. He's kicked four goals, Smith. And he tries a short one. Oh, it didn't come off. It's Andy Wilson with the Essendon coming away with the ball. Wilson gets it to the wing position on the southern side. In comes Cable once again. What a game he's playing. Cable kicks it back. Andy Wilson comes in there, but the ball beats everybody over the line. And there'll be a throw-in between North Melbourne's half-forward flank and the wing position on the southern side. Nolan and Moss once again. Mick gets his hand to the ball. It comes down to Wilson. Wilson has grabbed. It's Keith Brick making clear. The North Melbourne skipper going for a run along the southern flank. Oh, he's grabbed. He got a free kick. kick. Yes, he had bounced the ball when he was grabbed. There is no doubt in the world. And it's Keith Brick's free kick. 23 minutes of the final quarter gone. Three points of difference in favour of North Melbourne. What a beauty. And you're watching it on Channel 7, of course. Up comes Greg. He's kicking into this breeze. He's only about 50 metres out. But he kicks right across towards the face of goals. They fly high. And Moss from behind pulls down a great mark. What a player this fellow is. A hand pass by Moss goes over to Fletcher. Fletcher of Essendon tries to get it in towards the centre. Mick Nolan is there. He foils everybody else. Coming through there, we find Ick of North Melbourne. That's a big kick by Stephen Ick. What's going to happen here? Oh, Moss is that weary. Couldn't get away with it. And deliberately he's punches it mark. over the line. Yes, he's paid the mark. Well, so he should, Michael. A great mark to Moss. And what a great play. I'm 
Didn't have a title saying this, but by golly, he's played well as he gets the ball over the watts. He's got to kick it back again. He's pretty weary, Lou. Well, he'd have to be. Well, we're approaching the 25-minute mark, and the, the North are still three points in front. 23 minutes gone, actually. Is it 23, is it's it? Just on 24, Lou. 24. 24. Okay, the ball goes out. Every second cast now as we see Parts pick the ball up. Send the ball around towards that uh, wing position on the out, outer side. Going after it now as Files goes for a hand pass back here. And Maloney's got the run of the ball, picks it up nicely. Sends it right across to the half forward line, but on the wrong side of the ground as Wilson runs after it. And right on his tail is burning, the ball is out of bounds. Well, it's going to be very difficult for uh, the Bombers to get a goal from this side of the ground because play's been buttoned up here all day. Ball back into play, ready to go back into play. It'll be Crow and the big Nolan. Nolan gets it down to Burns. A beautiful hand pass to Chisnell. And North go back into business again. Up goes Douglas. Couldn't hold the mark. Oh, there's Dawson going too. He's trying to beat three of them. He's back Free kick. Hard. The umpire's yes. out. Free kick to Dawson. They're doing this with sheer guts, North Mel, at the moment. And plus a lot of brilliant play. Here's Dawson. Smith giving him a lead. He's ignoring that. Waiting on Dawson to send the ball up. Up to the full forward zone it goes. Oh, a beautiful mark to Douglas. What a mark. He's a fair way out, about 50 metres out. He's kicking to a strong breeze. 25 minutes gone, Lou. We're into time on. 25 minutes gone, and they're still leading by three points, but Douglas has kicked the cup. Oh, the breeze is really going in his face at the moment. There's the kick. Whoa, what is it? Smith got the mark. He's already kicked four goals. And he's on his right side because he's a right footer. He can hook this one too. He's only about 10 or 15 metres out. Let's see if Smith can do it. He's in the awkward position, as Lou Richards pointed out. By golly, it's going to be a hard one for him, but the strain is on him because it'll give him a nine-point lead. He runs oh, out. One point, and they go to a four-point lead north. Scoreboard now reads... At the 26-minute mark in the final quarter, North Melbourne, uh, eight goals, ten. That will be 58 to Essendon, seven, 12, 54. Four points of difference as Noonan kicks out once again. And it's a big kick from Noonan going to the northern side. Up they go, the North Melbourne players knock it forward here. Walsh of Essendon has it. He's going to get one in the back, I reckon. Bit lucky to get away with that. Cowton has the ball. But Walsh... Uh, he's uh, he's got to come back and kick over the mark. It was worth a try, though, I suppose. You can get away with it. The good value. The kick now from Walsh. Going to that wing position on the outer side. Cable is there for North. And Cable has taken the most beautiful mark that Barassi's ever seen, I've no doubt. Oh, what a tremendous match. What a beauty as Cable comes up now. 27 minutes gone. The kick going to the half-forward flank on that uh, northern side. Cowton knocks the ball away. In through comes Andrews. He was held. And he'll get a free kick, I reckon, Andrews. Yes. Roberts picking the ball up, returning it to Andrews. Andrews on the half-back flank on the northern side of the ground. That's a kick down towards center half-forward for the Bombers. The hands reach out for it. Here's a race. Who's going to come out? Wilson's in there, but it's Byrne of North. Byrne gets the ball back towards Cable. Cable's grabbed. He gets out of trouble. And a hand pass forward. Puts it over the boundary line, up towards that wing position between Essendon's half-forward flank and the wing position on the northern side. 28 minutes almost gone as we wait for the throw-in. Here it goes. Up goes Crow for that ball. Nobody able to break clear with it. It's not forward there by Shimmerbush. Uh, Shimmerbush is still going. He's set the ball. Final scoreboard here at the Arden Street Oval reads North Melbourne 8 10 58, Essendon 7 12 54. So join in the chorus. Here at the West.